I'm in Dead Horse, Alaska. That's the actual name of this place, Dead Horse. Um, I'm sure there's a story behind that, but I don't know. But uh, it's pretty cold here. Uh, it's about three and a half-ish hours north of Tulip Field Station, so about 12 hours north, 12 and a half hours north of Fairbanks. And this is the end of the Dalton Highway, which connects Fairbanks to the Arctic Ocean. Now this isn't the Arctic Ocean behind me. This is Lake Colleen. The Arctic Ocean's about 20 miles that way, and I can't get there because I don't have an oil permit. So this is where I will stop. Apparently they offer some, some sort of oil-flavored tours there, but those are really expensive, so uh, it's also really rainy. Um, so anyway, uh, take a look around. There's not much up here except for oil stuff. Uh, this is where they get all the oil that pumps to the transit la pumps through the Transit Alaska pipeline all the way down to the southern coast of Alaska. Um, so there's mostly oil folks up here. There was a uh, small general store where I just picked up a Red Bull for the drive back. Uh, why am I up here? I am picking up some research scientists from the airport. Uh, there's a tiny little Alaska Airlines thing. Airport is a very strong word for what it is. Uh, but it's up here and I'm picking them up in a couple hours. So I'm going to be putzing around here looking for eiders on this frozen lake. So that's what I'm up to. Um, again, Dead Horse, Alaska. If you want to look it up on a map, you can look up Dead Horse or Prudhoe Bay. It's also called Prudhoe Bay, which is the, the bay where they get the oil. 